Hey guys, this is the new 2016 BMW M5 dressed beautifully in Singapore grey metallic. This particular model is loaded with option. It comes with the competition package, driver assistant package, as well as the uh, executive package. The BMW M5 is a high performance version of the BMW 5 series. It is a four door luxury sedan with seating for five passengers. The M5 is the most powerful 5 series vehicle you can get as far as power and performance wise. Under the hood, it features a 4.4 liter BMW M twin power turbo V8 engine boasting 560 horsepower and 500 pound feet of torque. And with the available competition package, you get a slight increase in horsepower which is 575 which is at supercar level. The 560 horsepower response of the M5's new 4.4 liter V8 engine is nearly instantaneous. Double vanos, infinitely variable camshaft timing, and high precision direct injection play in concert with patent Favtronic individual intact valve control that eliminate the need for a less efficient throttle plate. The result is another M characteristic linear instantaneous delivery of a massive 500 pound feet of torque over an exceptional broad RPM range from idle to high rev. This result in 0 to 60 mile power of just 4.2 seconds. Now the MSRP on this vehicle is starting at $94,100. With the composition packet it adds $7,300. Driver assistant packet at another $1,700. And the executive package at $6,000 and the uh, Bang & Allison surround sound uh, system at another 3700 Destination charge is 995 and a gas guzzler charge of uh, $1,300 which bring the total price up to $115,095 US dollar. Looking at the front, this M5 model comes with the executive package which includes the full adaptive LED headlight with automatic high beam assist Full LED headlight provide all four lightning function, including low and high beams, cornering light, daytime running light, turn signal light. All lights are LED power and provide a wider, more powerful forward illumination for excellent visibility and reduce electrical power consumption. High intensity retractable headlight washer as well as park assist are also integrated into the aerodynamic front bumper. And here's a closer look at the BMW double kidney grill with the M5 badge on it, shadow line exterior trim. It also comes with intermittent windshield wipers with adjustable speed. Now moving to the side, the first thing you see is the cornering light as well as the side surround camera. This particular model comes with the upgraded 20 inch M light alloy wheels with 265-35 performance tires. Behind the wheel is the set of front rotors that use lightweight composite construction to provide better stopping performance while saving an incredible 42 pounds of unsprung rotational mass from the vehicle. Not to mention the huge brake caliber that will help the M5 stop even quicker. Brake caliber are painted in blue with M lettering on it. And here's the specific M5 fender with LED turn signal indicator, body color side view mirror, with the side surround camera built under the uh, side view mirror. On top you can see the sunroof that can be tilted up or slide open for an open air feeling. Rear wheels are also 20 inches and come stacked in width with 295 30 performance tire as well. Behind the rear wheel is also the ventilated brake disc and the brake caliber painted in blue. It also comes with anti-lock braking system, dynamic stability control including brake fade compensation, start off assistant, brake drying and brake standby feature with M dynamic mode. To the back, the first thing you will notice is the full LED tail light. Integrated into the tail light is the LED brake light as well as the LED turn signal light. LED tail light illuminate faster and help alert driver behind quicker to prevent possible accident. LD tail light looks very unique and stylish. At the bottom is the aerodynamic rear diffuser that frame the court round black tip exhaust with dual sound mode. Rear deflectors and park assist are also integrated to the rear bumper. And a closer look at the rear diffuser as well as the exhaust tip. 
rear view camera is located above the license plate and will activate once the vehicle is in reverse and there's the M5 badge on the trunk lid rear spoiler and the third LED brake light on top okay here I have the remote on the remote I have the unlock, lock, trunk release and panic button now let's open it up and check out the interior the car does come equipped with smart access key system so with the key in your pocket just press the button located on the door handle once to lock after a few seconds place your hand behind the door handle to unlock and as you can see the door does come with self close automatic door so if you fail to close it it'll close for you for the rear door as well the exterior color is known as Singapore gray metallic featuring a full black leather interior with silver accenting trims throughout very nice looking interior now let's jump into the driver's seat start it up and see how it sound so with your foot on the brake push the start button to start Now let's pop the hood and see what the 2016 BMW M5 have to offer. Under the hood is a 4.4 liter M twin power turbo V8 engine, 32 valve combines two M twin scroll turbocharger with variable valve control double vanos and Vaptronic and high precision direct injection 7 speed M double clutch transmission with drive logic auto start and stop function pushing out 560 horsepower 575 with the compensation package and 500 pound feet of torque can hit from 0 to 60 in a fast 4.2 second top speed is electronically limited at 155 mile per hour in the US EPA estimated fuel economy is 14 city 20 highway and 16 combined very impressive engine now let's shut it down and take a detailed look at the interior here is a look at the driver's side door panel it is all black with silver aluminum trims All four windows are fully automatic and there you have the uh, rear sunshade to block some of the sun out. Side view mirror control and it does feature folded option. And there you can also see the blind spot monitoring system integrated to the side view mirror. There you have the uh, two position memory setting and the Bang and Olufsen surround sound speaker there's the uh, tweeter also have the storage compartment on the door
BMW M5 aluminum door seal and there's the pedal and here's a closer look at the seat very nice upholstery material it does feature heated and ventilated option with M logo embossed on the headrest now both front seats does feature 20-way power front and multi-contour seat with 4-way lumbar support, articulated upper backrest, adjustable thigh support, passenger seat memory, and active head restraint with adjustable side support. Include two-position memory system for driver and front passenger seat, steering wheel, and outside mirror. The three-spoke design steering wheel is fully wrapped in black leather with M blue and red contrast stitching and M logo on the uh, steering wheel with silver accenting trims looks and feel very sporty it also features multi-function control side by side for your convenience with control for audio voice command cruise control as well as the most frequent use function in the vehicle behind the steering wheel you have the up and down pedal shifter so you can put it in manual mode for a more aggressive ride and behind the pedal shifter you have the uh, windshield wiper control to the left you have the turn signal light control and here's a look at the instrument cluster steering wheel does feature a power tilt and telescopic steering column as well as heated option over to the left you have the driver side air vent with beautiful trims there and there you have the uh, light control and the uh, instrument light control down here you have the uh, driver assistant uh, buttons and here's the storage compartment there you have the trunk release as well as the hood release lever okay here's a closer look at the dash with the uh, heads up display and the bang allison surround sound speaker in the middle now the full color heads up display which project uh, key information onto the windshield to appear directly in front of the driver to minimize uh, distraction. This particular model comes upgraded with the Bang & Allison's high-end surround sound system. The system features high quality surround sound thanks to 16 actively speaker located throughout the interior, pushing out a total of 1200 watts of beautifully balanced audio. Okay, now located centrally on the uh, dash, you have the large multimeter LCD display. It is not touchscreen. And there is the beautiful aluminum trims on the dash. And located on the center console is the controller to your infotainment system. You can turn it around to move around screen. Or press down to select. Very nice sound quality. And there you have the different menu button. As you can see, the system is very responsive. Very smooth system. And there's your different menu. Setting. There you have the option and the back button and that's the touchpad uh, controller knob. There's the uh, dual air vent, emergency has a light, the lock, auto start and stop and the push start button. And there's the uh, controller to your infotainment system which is the on and the off button. As you can see once I turn it on the Bang & Allison uh, speaker will raise up. And here's the full zone climate control. There you have two cup holders and a uh, 12 volt power plug. Okay, here you have the uh, gear shift lever with beautiful accenting trim. Looks and feel very nice in your hand. So you just put it into reverse, just push it up. And the uh, reverse camera will automatically appear on the multimedia screen. 
let's see there you go and the side view mirror will also tilt down guidance line will also uh, appear on the uh, screen to help you with a much easier backup and you can also choose a uh, different uh, camera angle and down again for neutral and over to the right for drive and sport mode that's when you can push it up or down to change gear or you can also use the uh, steering wheel mounted paddle shifter and over again for neutral and just uh, pull the P button up to get into a uh, park located next to the uh, gear lever you have the traction on and off, the steering wheel mode, the uh, suspension mode and the uh, different driving mode sport, sport plus and uh, efficient also there you have the park assist on and off and the camera button ashtray center storage compartment with a USB auxiliary input and 12 volt power plug and you also have the trunk lock button there and another look at the dash with the uh, glove box compartment a closer look at the seat once again very nice upholstery material it is very well padded as you can see now on top you have the SOS button to uh, use in case of an emergency in the one touch open and tilt sunroof very nice feature and there you have the light control rear view mirror with a integrated 3 button universal garage door opener hawk and tear headliner as you can see sun visor mirror with a card holder and there's the microphone okay now let's check out the rear seat Rear seating offers seating for three, and it does offer plenty of leg room as you can see. Very spacious in the back. And here's the look at the uh, rear driver side door panel with beautiful aluminum trim. And there's the Bang & Allison speaker. Rear windows are also automatic and you also have the uh, manual sunshade to block the sun out you have it on uh, both uh, rear windows now let's get into the uh, rear seat and see how it is in the back but uh, there you also have the M5 aluminum door sill and the uh, door storage compartment Okay, now let's jump into the uh, rear seat and see how it is in the back. But first, let me show you the look to the front cabin. Very spacious cabin. And here's the look to the top. Very comfortable in the back. Down there, you have the full zone climate control. It does feature heated option too. And storage compartment with 12 volt power plug. Okay, I'm 5'8", and this is how much leg room I have left with the seat all the way back. And there you have the rear seat pocket. So rear seating is very comfortable. It is very uh, well padded. And you do have plenty of leg room. Here's the look through the back. Full Alcantara back as well with the Bang & Allison surround sound speaker. In the middle you have the center armrest with two cup holders. And more storage compartment. And here you have the uh, pass through to get access to the trunk. Just push the uh, lever in the middle and you can pull it out. Okay. 
Okay. On top you have the uh, light control and the handball as well as the hook. One on each side. You also have another air vent there. Okay, now let's pop the uh, trunk and see how much cargo space the trunk offer. So the trunk in the M5 offer 14 cubic feet for cargo space, which is very decent for its class. And keep in mind that rear seat does not fold down. On the side you have more storage compartment and there's the hand-free trunk opening uh, instruction. Over here you have your manual and the uh, fuse box. More storage compartment down here. You have your tire kit. And there you have the uh, tools and the uh, manual release lever. There's your tool. lock button and the one touch close gas cap is located on the passenger side and it does require premium unleaded fuel only and holds approximately 21.1 gallons of fuel Overall, the 2016 BMW M5 is a high-performance vehicle which offer both luxurious and performance. Legroom and headroom will be fairly reasonable for any average size adult to be comfortable. The front cabins are very spacious and offer high quality upholstery material with nicely aluminum trims throughout. And not to mention the large multimedia screen and the multi-contour front seat guarantee you will be really comfortable now let's get into the front passenger seat and see how it is very spacious and very comfortable as well alright guys that is it for today's review I hope you guys enjoyed the new 2016 BMW M5 go ahead and leave me a comment letting me know how you guys like it don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more future video review and I'll see you guys on my next video review and before I go as usual I'm going to show you how it's like sitting in the uh, driver's seat So I do feel like I'm in a sport car with the uh, double clutch transmission and the uh, steering wheel mounted paddle shifter. You do get that feeling that uh, you're in a uh, super sport car and the uh, heads up display is very clear too as you can see. Very luxurious uh, ride, the ride quality are very smooth and you uh, still get that uh, performance uh, driving as well just gonna drive around and park it back to its base okay this is how it's looked like uh, backing up so you can see the guy that's line uh, helping you get a very easy backup Overall, this is one great vehicle to have. Alright guys, I'll see you guys next time.